see Shimon trying to play some Debussy, but he can't bloody voice. Everyone likes Shimon's fan page. He's very embarrassed. So this is Shimon and that's Mumu. Hi, I'm Umu. I'm the MC here. This is... I'm Shimon. <laughs> and this is... Hi, I'm Naoki. What? Yo. <laughs> this Come is on. Leah. Oh, oh that's Leah. Uh, no. Photoshopping blonde hair on her. On her? I beg yes. your pardon? <laughs> so if you haven't seen the Vix hide and great you reaction, Naoki is substituting for Leah, who originally reacts with Shimon for a while. Yeah. Yeah. Apparently, I talk more. <laughs> Have you guys been reading the comments? Uh, maybe. I so. The music that you'll be hearing throughout this whole Q&A video will be the songs that these two people have chosen to be in the video, so you'll be able to hear kind of like their favorite K-pop songs. Okay, so we will start with the question. In what was most surprising in watching K-pop for the first time? Shimon, you first. Hey man, time's going. It is we going. don't want to be here all day. I mean, like, I wasn't really too surprised because I like knew that it existed, and I kind of knew about the Korean culture. And I mean, there was no like big culture shock. I would say. Okay. What about you? I mean, my first video was that Jokel and Hyde video by Fix. That that was a great one. But all I can remember is maggots. <laughs> oh, and then walking backwards. And yeah. Oh, that was cool. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Also, like. Watching those videos that you uploaded mm -hmm. and like listening to like especially the the jackals that one, right? one? I don't I know. No, jackals are a nice one. Hide, hide is bad. I'm watching the hide one. Mm -hmm. I was like, wow, that's like really good. Like it feels pretty good music. Yeah. yeah. It's not too shabby. Oh, man. What do you guys most enjoy about K-pop? <laughs> <laughs> Or you just enjoyed the girls' visuals. <laughs> Let's leave it at nothing. We enjoyed it. <laughs> 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 <Just like, laughs> I didn't say anything. Neither did I. <laughs> but there is some non-verbal communication that the camera and I are missing. There's no water fountains on the well, go to the, floor. Go to the bathroom. Alright. Fill up with toilet water. Oh my god. That's so funny. <laughs> I don't get it! The thing is, like, we have never talked about it. Uh -huh. Like, we've talked about, oh wow, that was like... Because like after our first reaction, I was like, that was like so much fun. I was like, yeah, yeah. I had a lot of fun too. Yeah. And, I don't know, maybe we mentioned something about the song, something about the visuals. Right. But, like, <laughs> the way we immediately knew what we were thinking about <laughs> Which is? Or the visuals. <laughs> yes. There you go, ladies and gentlemen. Now no, 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 no. Love. Don't. I mean, a lot of people do watch K-pop for yeah. what's in the music videos and how beautiful the people are. So it's understandable. That's not necessarily my answer. <laughs> I think it's your answer. Oh, no. I'm pretty sure that's your answer. <laughs> what's your absolute favorite thing to eat? My favorite thing to eat is... Gyudong. It's basically beef over rice. I didn't realize it was right there, so I went down and went to the water fountain. Nice. It was like right next okay. to the other one. So he likes beef over rice. What's your favorite thing to eat? Uh, you mean Korean food or? Just whatever food. Or you like a Korean barbecue. And <laughs> what three things do you miss most about Japan? Konbini. Um, convenience store. <coughs> They're really nice, like 7-Eleven or Circle K or Lawson. Or at least it's in California. Yeah, but like it's different. Well, I don't know, maybe it is. Okay, well, yeah, I mean, see, Circle K is owned by the Japanese company in America. So 7-Elevens here are like crap. And okay. it's just nowhere, it's just not comparable. Okay, so you miss something in Japanese and then you miss convenience stores and then you... Miss baseball, Japanese baseball. Are the rules different? 
<laughs> that was three things. Your turn, Alfie. No, that was two. two. Baseball and convenience stores. The first one was Nyon. Or was that convenience stores in Japan? Yeah. <laughs> Combini. Combini. And then convenience. <laughs> Maybe. And then food. Actually, you know, oh, I, I was oh, like, oh, oh. You, know, <laughs> you know how you said like what my favorite room was? I actually take that back. Oh, okay. I think like I just missed the whole. You, you know how like when you get Japanese like facial food, like what's that? It's it's a bento. A, yeah, sure, like bento. You have like a little bit of everything, and then you have a bowl of rice, and it's so sweet. Okay, mm -hmm. so you have a big variety of things. Yeah, I really, well, I really missed that. I mean, you're also obsessed with rice, so that, that too. Yeah, yeah, yeah I love rice. Yeah. Wait, what do I miss about Japan? Yeah. Well, I've never lived there, so... Okay, so you're Japanese, but well, I, mean, I think you've been, you've been there enough to know. Yeah. The transport system, especially the trains. Oh, those are pretty true. pretty nice. Oh, amusement parks in New Zealand suck. So, you know, they've got some good ones in Japan. Like, Ghibli! Oh, sorry, that's the amusement park, but that's good. What? What did you say? Ghibli! Oh, that's a museum, though. I know, but aren't they gonna build it? I saw somewhere that they're gonna build it. I saw that. Oh, I what about the like hot spring amusement park? Did you see that? <laughs> <laughs> All right. Yeah, we'll Out of the groups you've seen. Oh, sorry for interrupting. My bad. You should be. Yeah. Yeah, we, we were sharing a moment. Yeah. You ruined it. Out of the groups you've seen so far, which ones are your favorite or which like one is your favorite? <laughs> All right. I don't know. Do I don't know names. Could you name like a certain music video that we remember? I mean, I really like Vicks. I mean. I did Some like of the girls' ones were pretty good. I like Blackpink. Yeah. So Apple and Blackpink. And oh, Blackpink is oh yeah, I see. Yeah, yeah. okay. Um. <laughs> and and uh, the racists. Uh, is that what, what she's looking racist. for? No, what, no the one that. Band? Band? Oh, Mama Mama <laughs> Moo. Yeah, I like Mama Moo. Sure. Mama Moo, Apple and Blackpink, and Vix and Blackpink. Oh yes. Do you guys listen to K-pop out of no. <laughs> here? No. <laughs> uh, what are your three favorite musical instruments? If you could play one other than your own, which would it be? Okay, if I could play one, it would be the cello. That is really nice. Like, just the register and the sound they produce. Wouldn't want to play the horn, because that just sounds like terrible. You've got two horn players in the room. <laughs> Why do you, you think I said that? <laughs> and what, what are your three favorite instruments? Uh, piano, cello. Uh, let's see. Hmm. Well, actually, there are some really cool horn parts. So, yeah, sure. Horn it is. Okay. Uh, I, I mean, you, you, you really nailed it, but my piano, cello. <laughs> oh. Wow! Know, like, there, it's, it's hard because, like, different combinations of instruments are also really nice. Because, like, normally, you know, I wouldn't want to listen to. Okay, maybe I shouldn't say that. Well, like, okay, so like solo viola, I probably wouldn't listen to. If I had, if I went to a recital and it said solo viola, I'd probably be like, okay, I'll go back to it. Um, but there was like the combination of like viola, a viola section, and the oboes. I really like. I can't even remember. Wait, in an orchestra? Yeah, in an orchestra. I can't remember where it's from and what what piece it's from either. But like, I remember this year going to an orchestra and hearing the violas and oboes and all the wow, that is a really nice sound. Yeah. And if I could play a different instrument, it would be piano. That's great. What languages can you speak? Are there any you want to study? Um, I'm fluent in English and Japanese. Um, You're fluent in English? <laughs> that, that wasn't funny, I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> that just fell. I mean, I'm just taking German, but I'm not, I can't speak German. Yeah, I speak English, obviously. Deutsch. Yeah, I'm learning Japanese. And pretty good, pretty good at it too. Yeah, 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 sure. And I learned Spanish and French, but don't remember either. I said bonjour, bonjour. <laughs> <laughs> Have you seen uh, Inglorious Bastards? Yeah. And it's like bonjour, Raymond Archie. That's the best part. Like, I will speak good. Italian. Third best. <laughs> <laughs> good move. Good move. <laughs> Moving on! Now, Key, what genre of music do you usually listen to? Uh, so, I mainly listen to classical, but I've been trying to expand my my taste. So, recently I've been getting into Love Queen and Eminem, so... Are you guys flattered and surprised about the amount of views and comments and fangirls slash fanboys you have received? 
I have none. Shimon has some. Uh, have you checked the comments, sure. sir? <laughs> uh, I have like one, so Shimon's like 20. Hello. Hi. How can we help? Hi! Oh, hi. I was oh. looking for the camera. Because you're at 545. Yeah, I'm at 545. Okay, so we'll finish this up as quickly as possible. Okay. And then right, see ya. have it. <laughs> no, she can sit. I mean, if we got a laugh track going, that'd be nice. Oh, that's true. Yeah. Yeah. You can be the one. Laugh at everything we say. <laughs> okay. So. Wait, what was the question? Oh, that's. Ah! I really don't know how to answer this. To say I'm very flattered. I am very flattered. There we go. What drew you to your instrument, and what made you decide to be a music major? Uh, well, mum got me playing piano at first because uh, she wanted me to be a conductor like Hogan Karyam. You know, superstar, you know, kind of. So uh, she's like, oh, all conductors on piano. So she started making me learn that, learning that when I was like four. So, yeah. So that's what drew you to an instrument. And then what about becoming a music Oh, uh, then eventually I grew to like it. You know, the usual. Yeah. <laughs> it was terrible for the first 10 years, but then, you know. And then you're just like, I love this. That's major in music. Well, I started playing better rap and I was like, oh, okay. That's more fun. I played baseball. That's all I did. And then middle school, I joined the band. I started on trumpet. And then I got to high school, I switched to horn. And it got to the point where I had to pick between music and baseball. And I Wait, you were thinking about going pro? Well, no, like, I wasn't. But I was like college. Yeah. Oh, like or just like just like continuing in high school. Oh. It was either continuing in high school. Or that was the same for me. Yeah. Yeah, because wait, I you played baseball as well? No, synchronized swimming. Oh, synchronized swimming. Yeah. That's like competitive and. Mm -hmm. And I chose music, and. I think I think what made me go into music was playing in an orchestra, and like the horn parts are like really irrelevant in a lot of pieces. Like we, okay, we don't have the melody for half, but like I still enjoyed playing like half notes and like just being part of the chord and then listening to the strings. And, like, mm -hmm. I mean, I could go on and on about this. Okay. Yeah. Ten minutes later. <laughs> <laughs> if you all went to Hogwarts, what house would you be in based on your personality? Like, have you taken the Hogwarts house test? I don't remember. Okay. I always get Griffin. I'm nice. pretty sure I'm like Ravenclaw. Do either of you watch anime and do you have any recommendations? Uh, I read manga. I don't really watch anime. Oh, I have seen, uh, what's, what's it called? Nichi Joe. That was hilarious. I'll show you some. I read manga though. Okay, so what manga recommendations do you have? Oh, I have, I've seen One Punch Man. Oh, that yeah, was yeah, a manga yeah, anime. I didn't read the manga for that. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Actually, we'll just move on. Best and worst things about being a music I see, major. I see. Wait, what? Sorry. Best and worst things about being a music major. Uh, how many hours we need to spend practicing to be good and not having a stable salary in the future. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So having to out music and pay also, like also, 10, se 10 cents a page when like your piece is like 80 page. It was like yeah, eight dollars to print out. I think what needs to happen is that like classical music needs to be publicized more and be enjoyed by younger people, like you. <laughs> I'm too excited. <laughs> I don't know. Because, like, could use a bit of music education program. Here? Well, I'm oh. from what I've heard in America. Yeah. Get like a system going. Or also, something. just like culturally and socially in America, classical music isn't a very big thing compared to places like in Europe or in like the Asian countries. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It's all about football. Yeah. Which is great. It but is great, but like. <laughs> What do you like most about majoring in music? I mean, being able to major in the thing that you want to do and love doing for the rest of your life. I, mean, I don't think it gets anywhere than that. I think just being able to do chamber music is a lot of fun with your friends. So we're, we were in a group last year and that was a lot of fun. That's awesome. Yeah. All right, do you have any... <laughs> True, it's just the greatest thing. He's staring up. Oh, it's never going to happen again. Oh. Anyways, what do you have to say to the channel people? Thanks for watching. Say something! <laughs> I don't talk, I'm the new Shimon. No oh, rip. No, I'm, I'm leaving. Like, no, so. <laughs> 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 oh, I need. Okay, stay, you can lick that. Like, stay, stay, like, stay, 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 stay. Get your ass no, down. No, I'm gonna stand up. I'll, I'll get, I'll get. Okay. Holy! <laughs> <laughs> don't break her! <laughs> <laughs>